At the first sign of sickness, whether that's an itchy throat, sneezing, or runny nose, I have a routine I like to do. So today I'm going to show you what I do to feel better and help my body heal. The first thing I like to do is start the morning with a green smoothie. My go-to is the Stripped Green Smoothie by Nutrition Stripped. This is a blog I found a couple of years ago and I really loved this recipe so I've been making it ever since. It's my go-to when I want a super green, nutrient-filled smoothie. It has so many amazing ingredients so I especially like drinking this when I'm not feeling my best so I can help my body fight whatever it is I have going on. I'll have a link to the complete recipe in the description box so you can check it out. And I made enough for two servings so I could have some leftover for the next day. I do prefer to make my smoothies fresh, but when I'm not feeling good, I'm all about making my life easier. And a second day green smoothie is way better than none at all. I also like to sip on warm teas all day long to help loosen up any mucus and congestion I might have. And one tea I always like to make is cinnamon ginger tea. For this I like to use fresh ginger root. I peel and cut it and add it to a pot of water along with a cinnamon stick. And I let it simmer for 10 to 15 minutes, sometimes a little more just depending on how strong I want it. And this tea is amazing as is, but sometimes I like to squeeze in some lemon juice. And another thing I always make sure to add is raw honey, especially if I have a cough or a lot of mucus. Honey is very soothing for the throat. And I'll basically drink this all day long while I rest. It's so important to take it easy when you're sick. Our bodies need rest in order to heal, so I make sure to get plenty of it. The next thing I do is take elderberry. This is my go-to supplement anytime I feel sick. And this is my first year trying a new brand. This one is by Ro Casa Organics. They sent me their sinus and allergy bundle so I could try and I am so grateful for this. The bundle comes with the elderberry, throat gargle, and a cough syrup. And they were also kind enough to send me their hand gel and two salves for me to try. I am so thankful for this because I had been dealing with allergies, I had a runny nose, and I was sneezing all day long, so I thought this would be the perfect time for me to try this whole set. Last week I took one tablespoon of this elderberry and the next day I no longer had a runny nose, I was no longer sneezing, so this stuff is amazing. Aside from the elderberries, it also has ginger, cinnamon and clove powder, vitamin C, raw honey, and lemon juice. So lots of really great ingredients to prevent and fight sickness. One of the symptoms I most dread is a sore throat. So anytime I feel even the slightest little tickle in my throat, I will gargle salt water. Usually I just mix half a teaspoon of salt and eight ounces of warm water, but this day I decided to try the throat gargle from the bundle. It also has salt and water, but it has an extra key ingredient, which is oregano essential oil. So all you do is add one to two tablespoons of this to half a cup of warm water and gargle for 15 to 30 seconds. So I also used this last week when I started feeling a little something going on in my throat and I was expecting for this to have a strong taste, but surprisingly, it didn't. I actually really like the taste of this. It's very subtle. So this, combined with the elderberry, got rid of whatever was going on in my body, and thankfully I didn't get a cough, but I'm sure the cough syrup works just as amazing as the other two. And Rokasa gave me a coupon you can use to get 20% off any of these products, and I'm not benefited or compensated in any way from the coupon or from mentioning them in this video. I'm simply sharing because they really helped me. So I'll have all their information in the description box below. I'm pretty good about drinking plenty of water on any regular day, but when I'm sick, I do my best to increase my intake just to keep my body hydrated and help flush out my system. Having warm, nourishing meals is also something I like to do 
on a daily basis of course, but especially if I'm sick. So this day I made a lentil soup, very simple and super quick. All I do is cook the lentils with garlic and onion, and while that's cooking, I saute onion and tomato. And this is a traditional soup in my culture, so this is how I learned to make it. And sauteing these gives the soup a lot of flavor, and a lot of people also add bacon to this, but I like to keep things healthy so I don't ever add it, and it's also very common to add carrots, but I didn't have any on hand. So once the vegetable mixture looks like this, it's ready to add to the soup. I also add a handful of cilantro and I let all of that simmer together for a few more minutes and then it's ready to serve. Right before I go to sleep, I also like to take an Epsom salt bath. It helps my body relax and soothes any achy muscles I might have. It also helps with congestion and just prepares my body for a restful night of sleep. So that's it for this video. These are all the things I like to do to help my body heal and feel better faster. So if you're currently sick, I hope you find my little routine helpful and I hope you feel better soon. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all next time.